Three, two, one, go, go, go. Here you go, Citrus Circuit, 1678. There's a shot that's good. Reloading. Oh, and it misses the reload. Shooting blanks for the Citrus Circuits. Right off the bat, the Blue Alliance is ready to start their cycle as they have no autonomous balls in play. The Penguin Empire, 25-51, pushing their red ball down the field. Citrus Circuit's getting hammered by 41-59. Cardinal Bottets, 45-98. The Rio Radicons pushing that red ball in. I think they're stuck high center. No, nope, maybe not. 25-51 pushes in the other red ball. Now we've got a blue ball in play for the Blue Alliance. Rio Radicon still trying to push that red ball in for a score. Citrus Circuit's getting heavily defended by Cardinal Botics, trying to get to that red ball. Red Alliance struggling to score that last autonomous ball. Meanwhile, the Blue Alliance gets a score leaving some parts on the field. Here goes the Blue Alliance inbounding another ball. Down on the field from 4185, the resistance. Resistance pushing that ball across the field. Passes into the middle zone and 4159, Cardinal Botics will take over with the blue ball. Red Alliance inbounds a ball. Citrus Circuit slamming into their alliance partner, 2551, the Penguin Empire. Up, up, and bouncing over the truss goes the ball for the Citrus Circuits and the Red Alliance. Citrus Circuits chasing that ball down, picking it up, and letting it go. Penguin Empire looking to shove the red ball in for a score if they can get to it. 23-67. Lancer Robotics playing some defense against that. And finally, that red ball jumps in. 41-59, Cardinal Botics trying to get a handle on the blue ball. 16 seconds left in the match. Red inbounds the ball, up and over the truss, bouncing into the corner. Can the Penguin Empire get to it and score it with 10 seconds left? Citrus Circuit's flying across the field, getting their way in there with four seconds, three seconds, two seconds, and at the buzzer, it goes in for the Red Alliance. 